What's up? Today, we are making a turkey and cheese grilled cheese french toast sandwich because user YT5ZT6TT6V commented saying he wanted a summer friendly sandwich that is healthy. And I feel like what's more healthy than eggs on bread with some turkey and cheese. And I feel like that's a summer sandwich. I feel like a, a turkey and cheese sandwich is what you eat when you're like out playing all day or like you're on the beach and you just eat a turkey sandwich. It's just refreshing. So we're gonna be doing that. And I think it's gonna be sick, man. It's gonna be sweet. All you're gonna need is a toaster, of course, two slices of some thick bread, some good old turkey, and any cheese of your choice. I'm using American cheese. I know this stuff is probably fake, but I just like this stuff, man. This stuff's good. You also need at least one egg. And I guess that's really it. I think that's pretty much all you need. If I forget something, you know, you'll know. I mean, a frying pan, um, a spatula, because I didn't say that last time. But let's get started on this amazing sandwich. Now, first things first, let's throw this bread in the toaster. Look at that. That's almost too thick to go in there. That's what she said. We're just going to shove it in there. Heck yeah, look at that. That's how you do it. And we're only gonna cook that on about four. And if you don't know, the number on the toaster is how many minutes it's being toasted. So if that's new information to you, subscribe, because I'm a genius. Love you guys. Um, now, I'm gonna get a bowl. We need one of those. And then we're going to put the egg in there and get started on all of the other stuff and preparing for the bread. So let's just crack this bad boy in there. Look at that. I think we should only need one. We might need more, but if we do, we can always get another egg. Now grab yourself a little fork and start whisking that. Look at that. Should be good. All right, now we got our frying pan, the egg is ready, and the toast is done cooking. So we're gonna pull that stuff out there. Oh yeah, it's a little crunchy already. I like it. And then, we're gonna make French toast how French toast is made. And that's by dipping the bread in the egg. Turn your stove top on like a medium high and then get your bread and dip it in the egg. And then we'll just get that all soaked. I should have gotten a different, a different bowl. So I'm gonna do that right now. I broke my bread trying to use that small bowl, but we got a big bowl now. So get a big enough bowl to put your bread in. Just get that thing soaked in there. Flip her over, get it soaked in there. Bam, French toast. And then we'll just throw that thing on the pan. Now we got two things of French toast cooking up and two bowls that are now dirty. Don't be like me, just use one. And now I'm turning this up to medium, just so it cooks a little faster, but it should be good. Now, while we let the French toast start cooking, we're gonna grab our turkey and get this stuff ready, which is basically just taking it out of the package. All right, now, once your sandwich is pretty crispy on the bottom, whoops, don't do that. Once it's crispy on the bottom, flip that John over and it's like, you can tell that it's crispy. This thing, is, this, this bread is weird. It's like, it doesn't get brown or nothing, but it's chilling, right? It looks good. So we'll do that. Throw yourself a slice of cheese on there, just like that. And then we'll do this turkey's a little messed up, not gonna lie, but throw us on some turkey, just like that. Then another slice of cheese. Then the rest of the turkey. Look at that. And then one more slice of cheese. I feel like I was holding that camera completely incorrect the whole time, but it's okay. And then we'll just put this right on top of that like that. I was trying to like hold the camera while doing everything. I cannot do that, man. I, I have to go back to putting it on the thing. So we'll, we'll see how bad the, the videography was right there. But for now, we need to grab ourselves a lid so that we can trap the heat in there. And we're just gonna let that cook like that. That'll get the cheese warm, the turkey warm. It'll be good. And then the bread, it's gonna get crunchy from the pan. 
So it's going to be sick. Now, once that's cooked for a little while, check out the arms. Heck yeah. We'll flip it over. Hopefully. Oh yeah, that cheese is melted. So, get that. Bam! Flip that John over. And then, put that lid back on. I'm going to turn down the flame a little bit. Because that thing looks a little too crispy. Look at that thing. I mean, I guess it's like, it's French toast color, man. That's what's up. That's how you make it. All right, now that it's cooked for a bit longer, check it out. Make sure you're not burning the other side like I burnt on the first side. Oh, yeah, that's good. Bam. Look at that sandwich, guys. That's crunchy, boy. That's what I'm talking about. That live food review. Super simple, super easy. I think anybody can make this. But boy, this looks good. Mm-hmm. That is what I'm talking about, man. This can make a grown man cry. Oh, yeah. There's got to be at least 40 grams of protein. Yeah, the calories are a little high, but... That's what you get for eating a sandwich, man. But heck, yeah. This is what's up. I can still eat this on a cut. If I can eat this on a cut, you can probably eat this on a cut too. But that is it for the grilled turkey and cheese French toast sandwich. That thing's pretty fire. And the eggs add extra protein, all right? Might not be a whole lot, but there is some more protein in it. Get jacked. Eat good. Go to the gym. I'll see you guys tomorrow. We'll be hitting some triceps and shoulders. That sounds fire. So... See you. I mean, look at that thing, dude. That's a thick chunk of meat. Mm-hmm.